This is our video tech tip on our 5600 series compression lock prism poles. This is a single section, but the concept and parts replacement is the same if you have a, a 12 foot or 15 foot multiple section uh, compression lock pole. Uh, part replacement on this pole is very minimal. Maintenance is very simple. Uh, the, the brass lock ring is the normal wear item. To get to the compression ring, remove your adjustable tip or your jam nut if you have a pole that doesn't have the adjustable tip. This allows the uh, compression locks to slide right off. Loosen your collet, pull it off. This is a brass ring that wears. Uh, you can flip it over. Uh, once you replace this part here and the locking is still poor, or not back to new, then you may have to replace this here. I'd actually order these two as a set, probably be better. Uh, and that should improve your locking. If that does not improve your locking, then the male part here is worn out and therefore you can never improve your locking. This is a pressed in piece and to replace all this here, you're better off buying a new pole after many years of wear. So it should lock and unlock very easily. Uh, never use any lubricant. We recommend this here clean and dry in the threads. Uh, lubricant can act as a, a lapping compound and actually increase uh, the wear. Uh, then you'll get to a point that's very hard to unlock it and that's the indication that your thread mesh is worn out uh, and parts will have to be replaced. Just to tip back into the original place. Uh, the vial holder can be replaced as a part as the point. Uh, all the other items, the outer and the graduated inner are a set uh, and at that price, you're better off buying a whole pole. Clean and dry, no lubricant, only lubricant area should be on the point. Thank you.